here she's explaining how the bat, they're talking about the basketball court, the football court, how these um, fields and these um, games are actually set up just like the courts that you see. So they're just explaining it. Judge. This is why, historically, you have heard about members of the clergy who have brought about such reform. So, in the history, when they talk about William Penn, for example, who was a Quaker. Set up a colony that allowed religious toleration because people wanted to leave Great Britain, leave the jurisdiction of Great Britain because they were being persecuted for their religious beliefs. I think she's and talking about the male flower. The Mayflower um, contract. What was happening to these people was that they were challenging the jurisdiction of the king. It was not based upon religion as a faith. It was based upon religion as a government. So when you talk about the Catholic Church, it is a government. When they wanted to set up the Anglican Church, it was a government. The Church of England was the first Anglican church, which um, was allowed, I think, by uh, Henry VIII, I'm not sure, allowed the Anglican church to be, you know, the church was already set up, but it was Henry VIII who brought the Anglican church under his jurisdiction. So then the king had the power to appoint the Archbishop of Canterbury. Do you know where Canterbury is? We talked about 
talked about that in Magna Carta. Can you read over So what happened was in Johnny English, they talk about you. That's where I heard about this um, Canterbury. Canterbury, she's saying, is actually Delaware, which would explain why the orphans registry that we're registered on is in Canterbury, which is Delaware. Anyway, she's going on to explain how all these different churches were set up um, and now then known as different jurisdictions. So they weren't collecting taxes for the king like they were supposed to. All the taxation, the tributes were going directly to, I guess, the Pope or whoever was in charge, the Archbishop of that particular church. Hence, that's what created all the, um, well, not all, but there were some dissensions. Now, she's talking about the William Penn. I was researching yesterday about the Mayflower. The Mayflower is a contract that was written between certain people who um, left um, that particular church, the original church, and set up their own jurisdiction elsewhere. And I think they were supposed to end up in one particular place and they ended up in Virginia, which created a lot of confusion because the native, us, the indigenous people were not expecting them. We had no contract with them. And then they, they proceeded to, to fight and war with us. And according to this movie, they were saying how it didn't end great for us. But I had also heard as Maroon, Seminelli, the tribes that we are, we actually did a lot of fighting and protected ourselves from a lot of that stuff, which is not are recorded in history, and we still stand today. So anyways, the Mr. Bean movie that talks about Canterbury, or it, the Canterbury is in that movie, is Johnny English. Johnny English movie was also explaining about all these so-called jails that were set up globally, and how they'd given um, these ministers of all these different countries to control these different jails that were in America. So America has the most amount of jails per capita in any, compared to anywhere else in the world. And I guess a lot of the people, the entities that are in those jails are the Caucasians, the mislabeled Hispanics, the mislabeled Latinos, and the mislabeled Blacks, which are really all Moors. So what happened was she was saying that the Moors allowed the Khazarian Jews to come into America by helping them to change their name and their identity. Hence all the identity theft we're now see, seeing here as Moors um, with the same Khazarian Jews doing the DNA testing. All those corporate shells, those co companies are to steal our birthright. So they tried to set up the Aryan race at one point and tried to claim that they were the original people on the lands, which is still going on today. So people wake up like, share, subscribe. I'll do another video with some more information. <laughs> 